Welcome back. In the last video, we discussed what we like about the note business, why we like it so much. And in this video, what I want to tell you about is how we mitigate risk. We, we realize that all forms of investing are risky, whether you're in a stock market, you're in real estate, you're in the note space that we are in, there is risk. And let's face it, folks, if you uh, risk versus reward is a true statement, I don't care what you're investing in. So how we mitigate risk? We mitigate risk primarily through education and information. This is a very intense information driven space that we are in. The more information we can gather, the less risk we are taking on. As we're Working through this business, we are constantly gathering information, making sure that our investments are staying safe and secure. And we are making sure that if there are any senior lean positions ahead of us, we want to make sure that those debts are being paid either by the borrower or in some cases we actually pay them ourselves. We have the obligation, we have the right to go ahead and protect our investment by making those payments on behalf of the borrower. Uh, more about that in a, um, case examples that we have in future videos that you'll see. But mitigating risk is all about education and information. So let's get into the education part of it first. When I, I explain to my students, I say, listen, if I hand you this black box, would you give me $10,000 for it? You have no idea what's in it. You have absolutely no idea. Does it sound like something that you'd be interested in? Uh, the box isn't very big. Uh, it might come in the size of like a folder. And you're thinking to yourself, why in the world would I ever pay $10,000 for something completely unknown on what the contents are? So as we start to discover what the contents are actually included in, we are now eliminating some of the risk. It would be very risky if you plunked down $10,000 on something that you had absolutely no idea what was in the box. And I'm doing this extreme situation here to give you the impact of what it is we're, we're trying to accomplish here. So as we start to open up this black box and discover the contents and we're examining sheet by sheet the property, we're examining sheet by sheet how this mortgage was written, what the interest rate is, where the property is located, all of the things that are needed to evaluate the purchase of this black box, the more information we uncover, we discover that, hey, this black box contains a mortgage where the borrower would owe us $93,000. And I have the opportunity to buy it for $10,000. As I begin and I continue to uncover the information that is in that folder, in that black box, I discover that we stand a very good chance of getting paid at least half of what's inside that folder, meaning half of that $93,000. That's my determination. That is my estimation of what we are going to make on that one purchase of that $10,000 purchase price. It's information driven, but let's face it, folks, it's education driven. When I say it's education driven, you need to know what the heck you're looking at and how to evaluate the information that's inside that little black box. And as we start to uncover the information that's in there, like I said, we realize that, hey, we have a good chance of making uh, some serious money on this thing. Or we open up the black box and we determine there is no way in the world that I would ever pay even $2,000 for what's inside this black box because my discovery of the information determined determines to me 
that this is in fact a very risky note even at a two thousand dollar purchase price the borrower owes ninety three thousand dollars i get it but it looks highly unlikely that this borrower in this situation will ever be able to make a payment to us and that's the information again and the education that i've gathered and that i'm using to my advantage and to your advantage as a student to make that determination for yourself. That's where most of the people in this note space get tripped up. They get tripped up because they don't have the evaluation techniques down to where they can say, yeah, you know what, I think we'll make $41,000 on this deal over the next five years or over the next 10 years or whatever the evaluation we determine comes out to. And so that's where most students that have even taken other education programs, they end up coming and taking mine. Because what we do here at No Conference is we sit down with the student and evaluate that note right alongside them, that black box, to determine whether it's worth $2,000, $10,000, or zero. And a lot of notes that we look at are worthless. So yeah, there's risk and there's reward. We mitigate the risk through what? Education and information. That's the key. And so when we are doing this analysis and evaluation, you have the right tools to, to make these determinations. You will be successful in this business. And uh, so that's it for uh, mitigating risk. I hope this helped in your process of figuring out what this business actually is and how it works. Okay, so catch us on the next video. Thanks.